Hey, what's up, what's up, what's up, family? Welcome to another edition of Wisdom Wednesday. You know how we get out every single Wednesday. I just try to bring you a different way of looking at whatever situation you're going through because, as I always say, this is my passion. My passion is to make sure that all of you, that me included, understand that we have something special inside of us that can change the world. And if anything, it can change our family and the trajectory that we were once headed on based on the new decisions that we make. And so I'm just trying to give you some new way, a new way of thinking about different things. So anyway, so today I want to talk to you about an old story that, that we, we constantly hear about. And, and some of you may have heard, some of you may not have heard this story before, but the story about how they change, how they train baby elephants. And the reason why I want to talk to you about this story is because I want to tell you how important it is to break, to break the chains that, unfortunately, when we were small, growing up in a certain environment, we became conditioned to think one way. So when a baby elephant is small, what they do is they they, they take a collar and put it around its neck, and then they take a chain and they take a, a stake and hammer it into the ground. That's how they train it. And so every day the baby elephant's trying to move and trying to break the chain because um, it wants to roam around. It wants to, it knows something inside of it. It's supposed to be roaming around. It's not supposed to be stuck in this space. Just like us, we're not supposed to be stuck in the space that we're currently in. And so what it does is it's constantly trying to move, constantly trying to move, constantly trying to break away from that position but because it's so small and at the time that chain and that stake is so much bigger as it's trying it can't break it as we're trying different things happen and it seems like we can't break through but what happens is the elephant is getting fed every single day so it gets bigger and bigger and bigger but because it couldn't break through that position that it was in Eventually, it stopped trying. And so they took the, the chain from, um, from off the elephant. They pulled up the stake because they knew at that time that they had it conditioned to only roam so far. Even though that elephant could have definitely broke that chain that was holding it back because it was so much more powerful than that current condition. But it allowed that condition to keep it in that, that position. We're so much more powerful than the problems that come up against us. But a lot of times we give up and we get into it instead of continuing to push. Instead of continuing to push past the pain to get us into the promise. We give up. Our brain power is so much more powerful than that current condition. We just have to stay with it. We just have to not give up. But so many of us give up and we end up adapting to the environment. Because as that baby elephant was looking around, it seen other elephants and they weren't roaming around. They were staying in position. And a lot of times we're looking at our environment and we're looking at our friends and we're looking at different people who are conditioned to stay in a certain position. Even though we have something so powerful inside of us to break through any chain, but we hold the position. We got to break through. We got to say, you know what? I'm too powerful for this current position that I'm in. I got to break through this. And I'm going to break through it because other people are roaming around. Other people have broken the position and they're roaming around and they're doing some phenomenal things. That can be you, but you have to understand that your environment won't dictate what your success is going to be. Other people are doing it. That means you can do it. You just have to change your mindset. You got to break through the chains that have chained you up to keep you in that position. You're more powerful than that. That elephant is more powerful than that. It was just because when it was a baby, it was conditioned to stay there. It was just because when we were young, we thought that all we can do was what we seen around us. But if we would have went down the street or we would have went a couple miles away, we would have seen other people living in a different environment than what we're living. And we could see that they're doing some great things. Just because we're in that particular environment doesn't mean that that environment has to get inside of us. So come on, y'all. Let's break through these chains. Let's break through these chains. Let's be powerful. Let's do the things that we're supposed to do to have the things we're supposed to have. All right, y'all. You can live ordinary. You can live extraordinary.
peace.